integral of the following. Uh, this is a little tricky. What we need to do is use a trick here. Um, so sine squared x is the same thing as 1 minus cosine squared x. So what we're going to do is do that. We'll have sine of x, and then we'll have 1 minus cosine squared of x. But then we're going to distribute the cosine raised to the fifth across this. So we end up with sine of x times cosine to the fifth of x fifth uh, minus cosine to the seventh of x. All right, and then this is going to be dx. So we'll set u equal to um, cosine of x, and du is going to be equal to negative sine of x. All right. So, have the negative out here because there's no negative, and we have um, u to the fifth minus u to the seventh, du. And when we integrate this, we get uh, u to the sixth over six minus u to the eighth over eight plus c. Maybe we can distribute that minus sign. We'll distribute the minus sign and then we'll, we'll substitute back in so we end up with cosine raised to the eighth over eight minus cosine to the sixth over six plus c. And that's it. Okay, I hope this helped you out. I appreciate you watching this video and you have yourself a great day.